Here we are in Palm, Mallorca. We're here for the Axapar dealer days. We have behind us the Axapar 25, a very exciting boat for the Axapars in Australia and worldwide. But what is great about this boat, it's a 25 foot boat. It is trailable. We have a lot of people who want a, a larger boat than the 22 uh, and the 28 just gets a little bit, uh, a bit too big to trailer in Australia for most vehicles. This boat is 2.23 metres wide, so well under uh, legal width but still has all the Axapar qualities. So at, as you see here, we've got, like all the boats, we have the twin stepped hulls, very defined chines. This boat does have a bow thruster, which is really cool. I'm loving that. And look at the detail of it. Very similar to the 22. You've got a three piece mold. You've got a defined uh, step in with the Axapar insignia on it. Powered by a Mercury 250 horsepower. This boat's gonna get along at just north of 40 knots, which is quite uh, sufficient for a 25 foot boat. Let's step on board, but like straight away, you see we've got a, a ski pole nicely integrated above the, uh, the engine. The engine can trim up with no interference. And stepping on board, look straight away, I think for Australia, having this T-top is amazing. I'm five foot 10 there's no problems whatsoever. All the way forward, this is the lowest point here, which I'm gonna say is about 5'11". There's a few different options back here. This is the U-shaped seating. You can either have this, you can have nothing, or the multi-storage, which is a, a quite a large sunbed on here. Sits a bit higher with a lot of room to uh, place your belongings. Actually, what's quite cool with this boat that we uh, we just noticed is it's got a full zip up clear system so because you have the the forward cabin here you can fully encapsulate this this whole cockpit area which kind of turns this boat into a comfortable overnighter really easily if you do have the table option here you can drop the table right down this cushion will go on top and fill this whole area in now think about this you got a 25 foot boat if you did have the clears all the way around, this is a second bed. You can sleep up here, put the kids up front, or vice versa. You could be sleeping four people on this boat and really having a bit of a, a weekend adventure, which is really cool. As we come forward, pretty standard with uh, the Axapar 28, is we have a sink, and we also have a good size uh, refrigerator here. Look, you could stand bottles up there. You could probably put at least a case of beer in there, at least. These chairs do swing around and make this whole area a complete circle of uh, entertaining. With a table centrally placed in the center here, this one doesn't have it, but you have a table here. You know, you sort of got a good, good seating area for three, four, five, six, yeah, eight people which is practical on this. Um, under this floor here, we've got some great storage, obviously some uh, rope uh, hangers, chargers, some batteries and, and power steering, but there's a bit of gear in here for the boat show, but um, this is a really neat storage area on a 25 foot boat. This helm area is really cool, really functional. This is ergonomic. My hand my arm is positioned nicely here. Wheel, left hand on the, on the wheel. We have our trim tab, as Axapar is commonly known with. The nice Simrad display straight in front of us. Everything's JL Audio control here. You know, simple, minimalistic uh, buttons for navigation lights, bilge, pu uh, bilge pumps and horn, plus a, uh, a waterproof USB. I think they're a double socket. Yep, a double socket. You can charge your phone, um, have your music going. Everything is very easy operate this is really cool so we've got a quite a large windshield here this is in the up position so as you see we don't have a lot of clearance here which is is nice for protection of everyone at the helm and also further back a few little turn turns of a screw you bring it right down now this is I'm looking straight over this window when leaning against the bolster here that's great, you know, especially when it's a bit rougher, you've got a bit more uh, leverage, or just for comfort to sit down here, I'm still looking perfectly through the window, but on those windier days, which isn't hard, you just 
put the window up. That's huge, that's really cool. Very good visibility, no distortion. Come downstairs, because this is really cool. So look, just remember guys, this is a 25 foot boat, but take it for what it is. This is a great bed here. We have a toilet, or what would normally be a toilet here. And this is where you can also have a sink. Simple functions of some fuses. Let me show you the size of this bed, right? That's pretty good size. This is actually a really big bed for a 25 footer. This is cool. Down here also, really smart. Never seen this before on a, on a boat. Get your telephone, you put it in this little pocket and it's a charger and it's charging on the, uh, like that. So a couple of speakers down here for the JL audio system. At least got six speakers on board. Should sound really nice, all encapsulated here. Simple storage, put all your knickknacks, boat gear, things like that in there. Another big standout feature of this boat <laughs> is we come up the front here and we have a bow lounge area. Bit of a first for the Axapar range to, to not have a complete walk around, but a, a cabin up front as well as this lounging area. Really nice, you know, perfect for two people. They integrate a, a handle into the center. You've got a handle on the, on the side, obviously, with the rail. Probably not going to be up here if you're, if you're blasting along too quick, but for a nice, simple cruise along or while at rest, this is spectacular. Love it. This is so cool. Anchor well up front. There is a, uh, a, an electric anchor option, which is on um, the Brabus 300, but just an electric anchor up here. A couple of nice cup holders also integrated into these cushions. Really smart, really simple. That's the Axapar 25. If you did like this video, like and subscribe. For further information, please reach out, out to us at eYachts and we'll be more than happy to provide you with all the information you're looking for.